surrounds a middle Smithfield Township supervisor who owns the land where the club developer wants to build. News 13's Tiana McLeese reports on tonight's hearing and why some residents are against the strip club coming to town. Not those buildings be considered dwellings. They have kitchens. Objection. Residents continue attacking zoning plans for this proposed strip club. But legalities aside, they say this is also a moral issue. From a business point of view, it's a bad move. But also from a personal point of view, it's just not the kind of uh, business we want. There's much worse going on than the strip club. And I really think it could be beneficial financially. The perception attached to so-called gentlemen's clubs continue to drive this debate. So we took a ride over to Thrills, the county's only existing nude bar, to see if residents' concerns ring true. There is heavy drug usage. There's certainly a lot of, you know, drinking. And for the uh, young people, I don't think that's... Uh... There's enough trouble out there now. Thrills is currently involved in a lawsuit with Jackson Township, so the owner would not allow our cameras in. However, we did find this all-access YouTube footage that gives you somewhat of an idea of what goes on inside. It's not visible from 209. This particular club has nothing to do with the Middle Smithfield Township case, but the property it sits on is very similar to that of Weary's Pub. If you take a look over here, you can see it sits on Route 715, which is a busy thoroughfare. Route 209 is even busier. And then right across the street from this nightclub, there's a church. There's a church that sits right across the street from Weary's Pub. Well, I've represented many, many clubs since 1995. And to tell you the truth, I have never seen a community welcome an adult business into that community. Thrill's owner Ira Weiner goes on to say his club is upscale in proof that adult businesses do not have to be a nuisance in the community. Members of the Primera Iglesia Church across the street say this. With this owner right now, it hasn't been really bad as the, the one that was there before. And the owner of this club doesn't have any respect at all for moving right next to a church. The Middle Smithfield Township Zoning Board will continue meeting to decide this issue. The date for the next hearing is yet to be announced. Reporting in Monroe County, Tiana McLeese, News 13. State gaming officials. A proposed in Middle Smithfield Township continues. Last night, nearly 100 residents packed the zoning meeting to hear plans for the adult strip club. The controversy surrounds a Middle Smithfield Township supervisor who owns the land where the club developer wants to build. But legalities aside, residents say this is also a moral issue. There is heavy drug usage. There's certainly a lot of you know drinking involved with it. There's much worse going on than the strip club, and I really think it could be beneficial financially. The Middle Smithfield Township Zoning Board will continue meeting to decide the issue. The date for the next hearing has not yet been announced. More haggling today over a $31 million bond.